Margaret Ann, we may not be in France, but many across the nation still celebrate Bastille Day. It was the turning point of the French Revolution, and now many use it to celebrate the unity of their people. Our own Margaret Bernquist is talking to Mirandon Ferguson of Mirandon Renee Beauty to find a French look that you can celebrate with. Yeah, absolutely, and I kind of wish you were here when we were getting ready for the show. This would have been really helpful <laughs> then. But um, first, uh, tell me a little bit about what is the French look? All right, so we're here for Bastille Day. That's why I decided to wear my beret. Looking good. So, yes, when I did my research, French-inspired makeup, they like it to look effortless and flawless and super easy, but a bold lip. So for Bastille Day, I know they do a lot of celebrations, a lot of parades, a lot of parties. So I figured we'd make a party look for with a French theme. It's never too early to get ready for a party because it is Friday. So what do we need to know? Okay, so first we just simply wanded her hair with a curling iron. I just literally just wanded it around and we just tousled it. And then I just put it up in this nice top knot. Beautiful. And again, yeah. where were you at four o'clock this morning? The, doing this. Okay. <laughs> do it yeah. Next time. Yeah. We're going to do it here. And then all we done, literally ladies, a simple pencil. We went into the eye and just put the pencil right on the eye. This is super easy. And you can pick these up at a drugstore. All you need is a good brush. And let's square her off to the camera yeah, a little bit more look. because I think we're all taking notes at home. Yeah. And when you put that pencil on, you're just going to kind of smudge it right at the lash line. And then blending brush and just go in and just blend that out. It literally takes about five seconds and you have a nice smoky eye look that's ready for a day or night. And, and people talk about effortless and smoky eye in the same sentence, and I've just never thought it was effortless. And, but and it is. This like, is how. Absolutely. You just smudge it on and just blend it out. Okay. And yeah. <laughs> so any other French trends that we need to be on top of? This bold we? lip. I have this lip from a good friend, a glam sister of mine, Alora's House of Flawless, and it is the perfect color for a Parisian thing because they love their bold lips. It's the perfect red for that. Absolutely. And we both have it on, so I just wanted to show that it works perfectly with different skin tones. Absolutely, and it's <laughs> and it pops out, and yeah. it's not overpowering. But I mean, right. on, on a Friday morning, you've got something to celebrate. Yeah, might as well. It's gonna be Bastille Day, so we're celebrating. Okay, <laughs> we got a little chunk of time left. Anything else you want to show us? Well, I, you actually can learn this look. I'm more than happy to come into your home, actually, the Miranda Renee Beauty Academy. We come okay. in, and we can show you different looks that are inspired by. French themes or whatever, just whatever you would like to learn. All right, well, I'll see you in the makeup room after this. Let's and go. Maybe you can, you should do that. You can make us look a little bit bolder. <laughs> I love that. Uh, we'll send it back into Nicole.